welcome back to my channel. I'm Myra from Low Carb Love, and today we're gonna be making chips. Now, I don't know about you, but I am a huge snacker. I love snacking on chips and just all the junk. So we're gonna make a lighter, healthier, weight loss conscious chip. Now, the cool thing about this is that it is literally made with one ingredient that is like the base of the chip. Now, of course, if you wanna add a ranch or you wanna add some spice or you wanna add whatever, that's just additional to it. But I'm gonna show you how to make the actual chip. So all you need are eggs and water. So you probably already have this on hand, so you can definitely make this. Go grab your stuff, make it with me. The first thing we're gonna do is separate the egg whites from the yolks because we're only gonna be needing the egg whites. Now, I'm not 100% sure. I have not tried making it with carton egg whites. If you have, let me know. So we're gonna grab our bowl. I'm gonna go ahead and separate. There's probably an easier way to do this, but this is all I know how to do at the moment. Okay. Okay, so the goal is just do not get any yolk into your egg white, okay? Okay, so we have our egg yolks and our egg whites separated. Now, we're gonna just work on the egg whites. Okay, a little bit of water. You can use a stand mixer, you can use a whisk. I'm gonna use a little frother. And they do not need to get to stiff peaks. You just kind of wanna make them nice and frothy. Okay, so we just want frothy eggs like this. Now for this chip, you could literally make it just with egg whites. Like this right now, bake it, you have chips. But I do wanna add a little bit of flavor. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and add just some onion powder, garlic powder, a little pinch of salt, and give it another mix. Again, this here is just for flavor, completely optional. The chip will still turn out with, without any of this. Perfect. Okay, now for this recipe, because it is a little more liquidy, you wanna do it in a muffin tin. Okay, so typically you would think like, oh, we could do it in, on a cookie sheet. It probably could turn out, it would be a little bit messier. Like I think you just have to be more careful with like how you place it onto the baking sheet. But with this, you don't because there's, it's not gonna go anywhere. It's not gonna be messy. What I'm gonna do is just add a little bit of avocado oil and we're gonna go ahead and make our chips. Just place it right into your mold. You will have crispy little chips to snack on. These are super, super low calorie, super low in carbs. They are keto friendly, diabetic friendly, weight loss friendly. I mean, this is like the perfect snack. Not only that, but they are full of protein because egg whites are a great protein source. Okay, so roughly, you want about a teaspoon of the foamy egg whites. That is what's gonna give you a super crispy chip, okay? If a little bit more goes in there, it's fine, but you want the majority of it to be foamy and airy versus liquidy. And then, I just kinda wanna get creative with it and add a little bit of parm on top. Your chip will still turn out if you use absolutely nothing more than just the egg whites. So I topped it with just a little bit of parm. Now you just wanna make sure that your oven is preheated to 400 degrees. And this is going in for about 10 to 12 minutes, but we'll check on it in about 10 minutes. Okay, so while that's baking, I'm gonna go ahead and take my probiotics and prebiotics. These are by Seed. This is their DS1 Symbiotic. If you don't have a probiotic and prebiotic that you trust, I will leave this link in the description below. I've been taking Seed for over two years. It has made a world of a difference for my gut health. Remember, 70% of our immune system lives in our gut. So if you have issues with your bowel movements, I know TMI, but um, you know, just regularity, 
getting bloated after you eat, inflammation throughout your body. If your hair is falling out, you have migraines, like all of that stems from your gut. There are certain things that you wanna do, like eliminate seed oils, processed foods, excess sugar, like all of that just wrecks havoc on your gut. So of course you wanna do that, but I also highly recommend a high quality probiotic and prebiotic. It's a great place to start. So if you don't have one, I'm telling you this one right here is life changing. Like it has really, really made a world of a difference for me. I take two a day, that is it. So I'm taking mine right now, cheers these. And that's it. I don't worry about it. So if you don't have one, I'll leave it linked in the description below for you. Okay, so now we're gonna go ahead and check on our chips. Ooh, look at these little guys. We're gonna have to let them cool so they get nice and crispy, crunchy, okay? We'll do a little taste test right now so you can hear that texture. Look at this. Mmm. Low calorie, low carb, keto friendly, super, super clean. Literally no bad ingredients because it's literally made with egg whites. Now you can add any type of flavoring that you want to make them um, spicy, to do ranch, to do chipotle. I added a little bit of parm, which definitely does, I, I can taste a little bit of the parm, but it is optional. Like you do not need to add anything else and you will have crispy, crispy chips. This, I can literally feel so good about getting a bowl and going to sit down and watch a movie, literally guilt-free snack. You can use this for egg salad, chicken salad. Like if you make yourself a sandwich and then put like some Barbie, I don't know, like you, you just like be creative. Think about having a chip that you don't have to feel guilty about. If you're trying to lose weight, you can eat a big bowl of these and you'll be just fine. This is a high protein, low calorie chip. Okay, it literally took 15 minutes in the oven. You can literally make as many batches of these as you want and then store them in an airtight container and you have a crispy chip for a few days. I love chips, I love to snack, so this for me is a 10 out of 10. I can't wait for you to make it. If you like this video and this idea, make sure you hit that like button and don't forget to hit the little bell icon so that you're reminded every time I post a video, just like this one. Please share my channel with your friends, family, whether they're trying to lose weight, they're diabetic or just trying to make healthier choices in their life. My channel and recipes like this could be super helpful. But thank you so much for being here. I love you and I will see you on my next video. Mwah.